Hey guys, welcome to the stream. Uh, the plan was to, you know, do the analysis like I usually do, but I didn't have time for that, so I decided that I'm gonna do a live analysis because that's much easier <laughs> and uh, has a, you know, has a good side to it because you know you are a part of it too, so it's 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 nice. I'm good, how are you man? Good to see you guys. Rokasugi. <laughs> yeah, okay. If you say so. <laughs> if you like him, okay. Um, guys, welcome to the stream. Uh, don't forget to press the like button, uh, subscribe, all the shenanigans. Uh, right before we start, let's do this first. You want to create your dream team with 50% discounts or 20% or 30% discounts? Yes, you do. All you need to do is install App Gallery from Huawei. App Gallery is an official application store for Huawei devices. It's available for all Android devices and PC with emulators. Here, players can enjoy the exclusive content and gifts, special in game events, competitions, and rewards. You can join their Discord too. On their Discord, you will be made aware of about every single promotion that is happening right now so you can take advantage of it so basically what are you waiting for you can save yourself a lot of money just just do it you know just do it all the links are in the description of the youtube video and the stream okay now that we got that out of the way mar what's up man let's start talking about these guys so we have a total of six characters to talk today and it's gonna be awesome uh it, i mean it's gonna be awesome yeah why not <laughs> why not okay so first takasugi takasugi okay so, Takasugi comes with a team skill that gives every one 24% if you use 5 or more agility type Japanese players and he's a club player, play, club player killer. So against club player he is 15% stronger. Hello, hello, hello again, hello. Special skills are strong intercept with 455 momentum, high power tackle with 450, power block with 420. Uh, nice hidden skills. Uh, nice special skills. <laughs> Hidden skills are bond with two or more agility type Japanese players that gives everyone 3.5%. 3% bl uh, shield to everyone, which is nice. Uh, special skill block, so all special skills will have a force of 10% boost. That's why you see here it's all 10% boosted. Uh, we have Opposition, Fury and Scene of Fire, so stats plus 10% when matched up with an opponent who has Attack at the Scene of Fire, Fury Potential or a Hidden Skill, whatever. So, uh, yeah, okay. And the Skill Block Cancel, so he'll cancel up to two special skill blocks used against him. Okay, so... Um against everyone else but club players he's a whatever dribbler whatever passer whatever tackler whatever blocker and whatever interceptor he's kind of good when you when you look at the interceptors today like uh, passers he could uh, like intercept toughness type and stuff but he, that's not that's not something special here we have a 10% against these guys who have a fear potential, Sino of Fire. He is so 10% stronger. That is kind of nice. 75 block, that's nothing, that's not something out of the ordinary. 72 intercept, that's nice. And 77, 67 block. Again, dribble and pass look okay for a defender. Club player. Against club players. He looks nice, 64 dribble, 63 tackle, uh, 70 tackle, 78.7 block and 76.2 interception. 
doesn't look bad it's whatever but yeah doesn't look bad uh and with all the passes active so against club players with that uh opposition uh and uh, fiery sino of fire you have a guy that uh looks respectable with these numbers but uh how often will you actually see this in pvp that's my question you know because he has silent tackle in the shop he does wait did i did i give him a skill that he doesn't have let me one second I know no I don't know if it's in the shop but I know that he has it available No he doesn't Wait what are these skills Leia these skills suck these skills are not are not good these skills are not good <laughs> these skills left from the from that other guy from that yeah he has a forcible interception it is for 10 percent right okay let's 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 do it like this i mean this guy sucks <laughs> let's 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 be completely fair to each other this this guy is like intercept interception these guys i mean seriously block what you have invincible body block just i don't want to ruin your analysis of this guy but uh, he sucks Bob just made sure that this guy absolutely sucks i gotta be honest with you doesn't change much here. I gave him the skills of Igava by mistake. Doesn't change a lot though. Change something that he sucks even more now. Thank you, Cassia, for liking the stream. Thank you, thank you. So basically, like I said, doesn't change anything. He just, you know, yeah, Simon, what's up? <laughs> yeah, at least he has a role of a shielder. Well, we have a much better shielders, to be fair, so... Yeah. Like, uh, Summit was like late uh, 10 minutes after I figured out that the skills are wrong, man. Like, Summit was actually 10 minutes late to everyone here, so no, I will not acknowledge him. Summit sucks. 
<laughs> this guy sucks like Summit, so let's talk about Urabe. Urabe sucks too, let's talk about someone else. <laughs> okay, so... Uh, let, let, let me see how did you guys rate this Takasugi. Let me see how did you guys rate Takasugi. Because if you want to be a part of the rating, you can do that. You can join my Discord. The link is in the description of the video. And you can be a part of rating the players. You know, I will give you your opinion of these players. Then I will show you what I think and what is my rating of those players. So that you can, you know, have a complete picture of multiple opinions of these guys. Okay, so let me see. Takasugi, okay. Let me see, how did you rate that guy? Two ratings, one. Nice. One rating, two. Two ratings, three. Two ratings, four. And two guys rated him ten, actually. That's, that's beautiful. So... You rated him 6. That is your rating of Takasugi. Um, I think that's too much. <laughs> I think that's too much. Uh, yeah. Romoya, what's up, man? Marcus, what's up? <laughs> way too much that's way too much some of you guys say ah you know what i wouldn't say that he's so bad um i mean i guess that's fair six i guess that's fair uh, yeah let me show you my rating yeah, I'm not gonna change anything. I'm just gonna leave it at this six. I believe he's a six, you know. He's nothing special. Like um opponent attack at a scene of fire and fear potential, that's not something that is often. Um Yeah. He's not so bad. As, you know, he's not so bad. As... <laughs> uh, it's, it's crazy how you guys attacked me when I gave a little rating to some players. And now when, when I'm actually showing you your rating of these players, you'll actually fine with it. All of a sudden, everything is fine. Uh, he's not so bad, yeah. He's not so bad. He He's not, he's not anything special, though. Because most of the time you will just see this and this. And even with this, he... 69! 69, baby! Let's freaking go! I didn't, uh, I didn't do this, one second.
shut up. You're a virgin. Yeah. 69. Just shut up. You're a virgin. Yeah. He's a six. Let's talk about Urabe. Urabe. Comes with him skill that gives everyone 24%. Because why would club give a free 25 like cheap fucking bitches? 24% that's fucking disgusting, but let's continue. Uh, so, super subs, so stats 50% when playing as a substitute. Special skills are tenacious sliding tackle with 455, sudden boost interception with 440. So basically, not a single special skill that is his best special skill. That is his best solo tackle, that, I'll, I'll give you that. Um, Hidden skills are bond with three or more club players that gives everyone 2.5 percent. A bond with three or more club players that debuffs your opponent by 3.5 percent. Six percent. That's not something special. A will to win when superior. So when winning with the score. When with what could you actually win with other than the score, club? Please explain it. When winning with the score. This this company is fucking ridiculous. Like, uh, the amount of fucking stupid people work at this company is off the charts. Uh, when winning with the score stats 10%. Uh, full power gauge up Misaki, so teammate Misaki gets full power gauge up 10% when you win at a matchup. Whatever, trust, defensive, so uh, defenders get 5% to special skill force when your teammate uses the next skill after losing a matchup. That's nice, that's nice. Nothing else is nice though. Uh, okay, so as usual, as usual, we will first. He's winning with our hearts, yeah. So I don't get it. I don't get it. Why did you guys like like this guy? I I don't I don't see it. Uh, as a super sub, obviously, we'll not talk about this guy when you know he place at the first half so because he is like if he was if this game was new and this guy was just a list he would suck uh as a super sub whatever dribbler whatever passer good tackler whatever blocker and good interceptor so good tackle and good good uh, intercept that's basically it 75 as a super sub should be higher but i guess 75 okay uh when you win with the score 80 tackle and 80 block 80 tackle and 80 intercept and that's basically it yeah he's only a dm dm yeah he's only a dm that is additional thing that is really limiting so you gotta you gotta rate this guy as a defensive midfielder, you know. Dark Sky, what's up? <laughs> a great seven. And well meds, let's see what did you guys think about this guy. So let's me see. We ha oh my guys, you guys hate this guy. You guys hate him. So basically you gave him um the same rating as you gave to Takasugi. That's your opinion of Urabe. How do you mean six out of nine? <laughs> six. He should be. Med say Med says it's rigged. He should be at seven. I don't know, man. I I don't know. <laughs> I mean, I would. Uh, 
My rating is 5.5. <laughs> My rating is... 5. That's my rating. <laughs> yeah, a constant 80, but it's a super sub and when you're winning. So that's not something special. Like you have a lot of units that reach these numbers today and... Uh, so you have to win and you have to put this guy in the second in the second half to use this guy as a defensive midfielder. As a defensive midfielder who cannot pass, who cannot dribble, who cannot do anything else but tackle and block, doesn't have auto intercept, doesn't have skill block. This guy is a 5 and I'm generous. This guy is a 5 and I'm generous. No auto interception, only defensive midfielder, no skill block. I'm generous by, by giving him a 5, basically. <laughs> okay, who you want to talk about next, guys? <laughs> zero. Teach says 0 0.5. <laughs> my rating is 5 and I'm really being generous this guy is absolute trash like as only a defensive midfielder with no skill block no onto interception you have to win to actually be respectable he cannot pass, he cannot dribble he cannot do nothing, no skill block cancel he sucks uh, ok so we have Igawa, Misaki, Sorimachi and Kishida. Do you want to talk about Igawa next? Let's let's talk about Igawa. So Igawa comes with a team skill that gives everyone 25% if you use 5 or more skill type Japanese players and stealth defense as a passive so his icon flashing when he's fucking invisible. That's it. He's invisible. I don't know why his club like doing this stealth defense. His icon flashes. He is invisible. That's it. He is just pure and simple invisible. Just like Misugi. Uh, so. Okay, special skills are crush block with uh, 480 momentum, that's his best block, silent tackle with 455, that's his best tackle, we have wild cross 425, that's his best pass, and air ranked whatever. Hidden skills are bond with two or more skill type Japanese players that gives everyone, that debuffs your opponent by 7.5%, and nothing else. This is actually the first time we see this, like only debuff, without without uh, bonds without nothing else only 7.5 that is a huge debuff 7.5 auto block enhance 80 percent of activating a special skill during an automatic block which is nothing special but okay non-japanese player killer stats up 25 percent versus non-japanese players he's a shoot killer for non-flying shoots so additional five percent power against those and he is uh he has a skill block cancel so he cancels up to two special skill blocks used against him uh so against japanese players he is a uh, good Tackler with 68.7. So close. So close, guys. 75.5 block and 65.8 interception. Um, is his hard contact intercept in the shop right now? Because if it's not in the shop... <laughs> You're a virgin. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's interesting from a tournament so it's not in the shop so it's 
So this shop is completely useless. This shop was actually something good at first. Now this shop is completely fucking useless. Absolutely useless. This shop has like the most useless skills you will never need. DB shop. Absolutely useless. It was great at the start, now it fucking sucks. Yeah. And he had that with uh, that red version, right? That red version had that... Uh, is a gacha, regular gacha, so yeah, I mean, you can get it from regular gacha, so that's not so bad. Against shoots, he is a... 62.1 tackler, 79.3 blocker which is nice and 69 interceptor just shut up you're a virgin yeah 69 interceptor just shut up you're a virgin uh so basically when your opponent shoots you will not be able to bully him with tackle and intercept uh but you will be able to block it that's nice you can block uh, like agility type shooters i don't think that he can block yuga because of the color yeah that gives him some advantage but yuga is a block killer i don't think so he's close though he's not so bad there uh against non-japanese players he is 69 dribbler. Just shut up. You're a virgin. 69 passer. Just shut up. You're a virgin. 85.9 tackler, 94.4 blocker, and 82.2 interceptor. Which is really, really, really nice. He is on a bowling level all on three, mostly on his block, obviously. Uh, I mean, look at that. That's 95. That's constant power of Ishizaki's interception with full stamina against non-Japanese players. So yeah, he can bully guys with that. That's 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 really nice. And uh, against if your opponent shoots, you can actually bully him with 90 block, 85 intercept, and almost 100 block, which means basically that. No non-Japanese player will actually shoot over this guy. No chance. He will block everything. And um, if a non-Japanese player shoots, his auto block will probably stop most of these shoots. So I guess that has some kind of value. So um, if he shoots like uh, 20, 15 meters away from this guy, he will auto block it for sure. He should auto block it. Brian is this guy's bitch. Yeah, pretty much. Yeah, he's very good on high balls. Yep. <laughs> Jeffrey Marvan says he's really good, but still a virgin. <laughs> Jeffrey Marvan says he's good, but still a virgin. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, so let me see what did you guys think about this guy. Okay, uh, a lot of you actually gave him a rate of 1, which is... Nah, that, that's, 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 that's just ridiculous. He's not so bad. So... You rated this guy 7. That's your opinion of this guy. You rated this guy 7. And Mikael has 7. Slim has 7. Marcus says 7.5. Med says she should be 10 because, yeah, for Meds, everyone is 10. Um. You rate him 8.5. That's generous. 
it's not so bad but because he is a known japanese player killer which means that basically japanese players will just walk all over these guys and we know that these guys that club loves japanese players my rating of this guy is gonna be just shut up you're a virgin of course that's my opinion and as such is since as, as such stands <laughs> I mean, yeah, I gave him 6.9 as a joke, but um, yeah, I mean, all you need is a toughness type forward and he's completely murdered. Toughness type forward, uh, Japanese player and he is like easy dribble, easy 1-2, easy pass over him, no auto interception, uh, no skill block. I don't, yeah. Right now, there are no toughness type Japanese forwards. Like, uh, in like maybe two days, we might get them, and that's pretty much over. Sorimachi is actually really nice. He's not bad. Yeah. You're right. You you rated this guy seven. I rate him six point nine. I don't think he's so good. Um, as a central defender, Japanese players, no problem. Um, as a side defender, whatever you can pass over this guy. No other reception. No nothing. He's very good on high balls. So. That gives him additional value. He has color advantage against Hyuga, which is one of the most used forwards today. I mean, not really after the after we saw uh, Super Dream Fest, Brian and Levin. He's kind of on the sides, but still very very much used. So he has color advantage against him. He's not bad, but. Okay, maybe I'm gonna give him 7.1. Let's give him 7.1. That's that's generous. That's generous though. Is what? Summit, please, just his skill type. I mean, you are not helping at all. You are completely useless, man. Summit, this guy is skill type and you absolutely fucking suck. Let's talk about... Uh, well, who, who, who do you want to talk about that? Uh, sorry, Machi, Misaki or Kishida? Who next? Who's next? Shark Boy. Okay. Natureza, wait a bit. <laughs> you were late, guys. You were late. Okay. Uh, Kishida comes with a team skill that gives everyone 25%. Uh, if you use 5 or more toughness type Japanese players, and he's a side master. So his stats rise 20% when he is near the sidelines. Special skills are Shark Intercept with 490. Uh, momentum shark tackle with 405 and uh, shark diving block with 420 uh, and a and a strength shark dribble 4 a strength that's real nice 440 uh, the only skill that is not his most powerful there is his tackle he has cutting sliding so that's that's more powerful hidden skills are born with two or more toughness type japanese players that gives everyone five percent 
Okay, auto intercept the hand, 6%. Well, nice. But it will never activate. <laughs> auto intercept reduce. This is, this is really nice. Minus 20% chance of activation of opponent team skill, special skills by auto intercept hands. This is huge. 20% is huge, man. Price of confused fight. So minus 8% to starts when your matchup opponent selects the next command after you lose at a matchup, which is a huge debuff, but you can. Just pass yourself in the box, trap the ball, and that's gone. Because if it's price of confused fight, and if it's minus 8% to momentum, that is much, much more valuable. Because with 8% to stats, with price of confused fight to stats, you can trap the ball in the box. Uh, you can pass yourself in the box, trap the ball, and it's gone. While if your momentum is debuffed you must use a special skill to lose that price of confused fight so a bad out of the sidelines he is whatever dribbler and whatever passer uh, good interceptor tackle is kind of okay with 66 I would, I would use this guy only in a 4 defender line as a side defender. That way his passive will mostly be active. And uh, that's the only way I would use this guy. And I saw many of you actually use him in a 4 defender line on the sides. And then he shines really. So he is a 70 dribbler, 63.2 passer, which is really nice for a defender. You have 80 block, 87.8 interceptor and 74 blocker. 74 block it, whatever. You gotta see this too. So he has, if you use this guy as a constant side defender on, on the sides, like on a 4 defender line, he is a beautiful, beautiful defender to have there. Uh, not a bad passer and dribbler too, so... Yeah, auto intercept in hand, 60%. 20% auto intercept boost, that is beautiful. 8% is huge to, de to debuff if he does lose uh, a matchup, so... I don't hate this guy. I think he's really good. So, uh, let me see how did you rate this guy before I show you my opinion. Uh, I'm not kidding with you. This is your rating of uh, Ishida. You guys rated this guy 6.9. And I'm not even joking. Virgin. You guys rated this guy 6.9. That is too low. That is too low, man. <laughs> that is too low, in my opinion. That is too, too low. So he, you rated him 6.9. My rating of this guy is... So the only place I would use this guy, the only place he is usable, side defender, for defender line, that is not a tough thing to accomplish. And it's a good, we have a ton of good formations for that. So as a side defender in a four defender line, 7.8. I think he's, I think he's really nice. I think he's really nice. As an auto interceptor, auto intercept reduce 20%. Price of Confused Fight, if someone does get over you, he's 8% debuffed, which is beautiful. He is a bullying interceptor on the sides, even bullying tackler. He can even block sometimes, but you will not use that skill uh, in a 4 defender line on the sides. Uh, good dribbler, good passer. Yeah, I mean, I don't, I think he's, I think he's nice.
Okay, dark sky, please be be nice. <laughs> no, I will not pull. I don't need. Uh, I would need a uh, agility type defender, club defender. That's what I would pull for, but no. You want Misaki next? Okay, let's talk about Misaki next. I like Sinalo. I like Sinalo. I like him. <clears throat> okay. So Misaki comes with him skill gives everyone 25% if you use five or more agility type Japanese players and he's a mid area master so in the middle area he is 20% stronger. Special skills are dash turn tackle dash turn Tackle with uh, 470. Okay. And overhead interception 475. Really nice. Two of his most powerful defensive skills. And A ranked, whatever. He is a 7.5% debuffer if you use three or more Japanese player. That is easy to accomplish. This is huge debuff. Dribble killer, so if your opponent decides to use a dribble, you are 10% stronger. Special skills force up, so passing special skills gets a force bump of 8%. That's why it's 502 momentum. Uh, you have a direct hotline for Misaki, so every Japanese player gets 8%. To stats when it's selecting the S command after receiving a pass from him. 8% is absolutely huge. And he has a trust for defenders, so he buffs them up by 5% if he loses a matchup on their next command. Nice, uh, nice hidden abilities. Let's see how he looks though. So out of the middle area, he is a whatever dribbler. Uh, Urabe is OP super sub. Okay, then use him as a super sub. Uh, 68.5 pass. That's nothing special. 6612, that's nothing special. 66 tackle and 62.1 interceptor. Of course, if uh, you, if your open goes with dribble out of the middle area, he's a nice tackler at 72.7. That means he will probably win most uh, dribblers. Yeah, I mean, only like a skill type complete killers may dribble over him sometimes. And he's a 68.3 in that case, which means that he will not be able to bully them. Um, as a mid area master, obviously this guy's only position is somewhere in the middle of attacking midfielder area. Uh, I'm not sure if I would use this guy as a defensive midfielder because he doesn't have auto intercept. I would use him as an attacking midfielder in the middle, so you can basically have his passive mostly active. The problem is, uh, his passive will be a pain in the ass to activate. That is true. Milleria Master is like mm, I would say third tier special skill. It's 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 whatever. You know. Um in the middle area, he is 68.3 dribbler. That is nothing special. 82.2 pass, that is one of the best passers in the game, 81-2, that is really nice, 79.4 tackler and 74.5 interceptor, really good defensively, 
much much better defensively than offensively if you go like uh both of the dribble he will not dribble you know uh, that's that's kind of tough and the uh, pass is really nice he will bully toughness type interceptors with that uh that's 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 a really nice really really nice number um not bad defensively too in the middle area if your opponent goes with dribble, you are an absolute killer with 86 tackle and 80 intercept, which means that you will probably sometimes bully toughness type dribblers, uh, but uh, like mostly no one would get over you with a uh, with a dribble. So, Med says five. I don't know how I rate this guy, seriously. Because I like Misaki as a character, I don't like this guy particularly much. As a mid-area master, I mean, I mean, of course, in a huge debuff team, he will be really, really nice. But, out of it, no. There are some guys, debuff characters, that have absolutely ridiculous numbers while being in debuff uh or buff or whatever and there are some characters that shine only if you use a complete and utter debuff team and this is that guy this is the guy you want to use in a complete debuff team and in that way he would shine so um in a full debuff team as a central attacking midfielder or defensive midfielder with no auto intercept and no skill block. Let's see how did you rate this guy before I give my opinion because I really don't know how they rate this guy. I like Misaki, but I don't like this guy. So, you rated Misaki 7. You are really rough, guys. You are really rough. <laughs> you rated Misaki 7, okay. That's... Uh, that's not far off from where I would go. Uh, let's see. Marcus says 7.5. Uh, Med says 5. <laughs> Kaito says 6. Eugene says 6.6. One says 5.8. You guys, by democracy, rated him 7. What would be my rating? <laughs> yeah, Summit, I was I was thinking about going there. I was thinking about going there. I don't know, man. It's tough, you know. Kishida is absolute first class side defender. No doubt about that. Kishida is is a beautiful side defender in a four defender line. He is so good there. But Misaki is a central defender, not even close to that number, not even close. So you're gonna see these guys as uh, their role, where would they be used, like central attacking midfielder, defensive midfielder. As a defensive midfielder, his mid area master will be active more times than in attacking midfielder area. But as a defensive midfielder without auto intercept or at least that that passive from Shio from uh Shoshingo Sh Sh Shoshunko Shoshunko that that passive from Shoshunko um like when he jumps in a matchup if he's close 
That is not like, 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 guys. There is, it's really tough to rate any defensive midfielder a good score if he doesn't have auto intercept or uh, Shashunko, yeah. <laughs> or what? What's the passive of 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 Shashunko? I'm gonna call him Shashunko from now on. I'm gonna I'm gonna accept it, and I'm gonna call him Shashunko. So let's see. Follow, yeah. Dark Sky says treat him as an attacking midfielder. Okay, central attacking midfielder. He gives 8% to Japanese players when passing to them. That is absolutely ridiculous power. That is so good. He is a bullying pa passer in the middle area, so that that itself gives him really 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 good value as a central attacking midfielder as as a central attacking midfielder in a in a formation with three attacking midfielders he would find himself most of the time in the vital area because central attacking midfielder in a three defend in a three attacking midfield line he is like a second striker basically while I know, man. I think you were right. I wouldn't go higher than 7. I wouldn't go higher than 7. I don't think he's a complete meta character, like 8 or above. Um, yeah. I, would, I, I, I wouldn't go bigger than 7 to be... Completely fair with you. Mr. Bad Gamer, that is fair. If you love if you love Urabe, Meds loves Urabe too, so that's completely fair. Med says five. Okay, Med. <laughs> yeah, I'm rating him seven. I, I don't think he's nothing out of the ordinary. I don't think he is. Uh, of course, guys, take every of these opinions with a grain of salt. I would, I would, uh, uh, you know, advise all of you to not take this game too seriously. You know, if you like a character, if you want to use a character, if your main team, if you like Misaki, go for it. You will find a way to make this guy work if you love him, and if you know, like if you use him only exclusively for that, you will always be aware of that Misaki with a brutal power on pass and direct hotline. That is basically his most powerful weapon: bullying pass and direct hotline. That is why he is there to pass the ball to Hyuga, someone. Uh, in Japan and when he passes to them that's 8% is absolutely huge so that is his main power and uh, in the middle area he looks really nice defensively though but I wouldn't go more than 7 I know Kaito I would, I would rate him 8 only if he can score he cannot score you know Yes, Dark Sky, you're right there. If you guess the right thing, yeah, of course, you can win matchups. I'm not talking about that, though. That 7 is not a bad score. I know why you guys hate 7. 7 is not a bad score. That just means that for me, for my personal opinion, he's not top, top, top tier meta. He is really nice. He is a bully passer in a debuff team, huge debuff team. He will be absolutely ridiculous. But those are things that all come into play when you actually rate the guy and how actually hard it is to completely unlock the huge power of this character. This guy is really, really nice 
in a huge debuff team he is really really nice of course but there's that thing you know <laughs> yeah i mean yeah i mean i would i wouldn't go higher than seven i know guys uh who didn't we talk about still we didn't talk about only Sorimachi, right? Sorimachi is the only one left. Vortex, thank you, man. But I can tell you something I saw from Adler's gameplay. His hidden ability pass skill for sap is useless. Why? It makes his pass stronger. Why is it useless? He's not bad. He's not bad, by all means. In a huge debuff team, in a huge debuff team, as a central defensive midfielder, even there, or as a central attacking midfielder, yeah, really nice. But as a global, like watching it as a character, uh, my rating is 7. <laughs> Matt says my grandma is great in a huge debuff team <laughs> and he says five let's talk about Sorimachi yeah in a huge debuff team he will be dark yeah he will be just a murder you know in a huge debuff team but that that's 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 the thing man uh, that like i would use these guys as a defensive midfielder and that that's basically it is a defensive midfielder because then his passive will be active more but uh and he has trust so even if he loses a matchup he gives five percent boost to force or to 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 defenders so it's not bad uh and it it's it's much easier to pass over attacking midfielders there uh and to bully them with 82.2 so uh as attacking midfielder he will have a hard time against the meta defensive midfielders like like shoshunko like uh you know those powerful guys but uh and and defenders you know it's gonna be really hard for him against these meta defenders but um yeah not bad but nothing groundbreaking too he has a better dribble what 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 kind of dribble he it is how how much how much momentum is his most powerful dribble Touch and heal turn. Doesn't change much. Yeah, I did say Shoshunko. Not bad. He's not bad. But I wouldn't go like too high. <laughs> yeah, I'm learning I'm learning Chinese. <laughs> Seven. Let, 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 let's not be so rough. 7.3. Let's not be so rough. 7.2. Will I play PvP today? I don't know. I don't think so. Let's talk about Sorimachi. I'm probably gonna play PvP tomorrow. 
Uh, sorry much comes with team skill that gives everyone 25% if you use 5 or more toughness type Japanese players. And Tenacious Spirit is a passive, so his shoot rises by 13% every time you fail to score with a special skill with a matchup against an opponent goalkeeper until you score maximum 2 falls and what? Yeah, okay, 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 okay. Longest and hardest unit rating in 2022 till date. Yeah, but Pelita, I agree. I agree. Okay, special skills are Shadow Shoot with 455 momentum. What the hell? What is this? 4.6. <laughs> what? It's 460, right? <gasps> oh, yeah, 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 okay. <laughs> One second. Or 65. 539.4. Yeah. It's actually 539 because of uh, special skills for Sapt. Upt. Uh, special skills are Shadow Shoot with 455. I know why I didn't give, give him a better uh, solo shoot because he he would deserve it, but uh, yeah. That really takes the spot of him actually using his best shoot with Hyuga. So Sharp Ceaseless Stepping with 450, that is basically a lazy way of adding uh, the same dribble to everyone uh, cutting sliding the same lazy way of adding the same special skill to everyone 450 and sensing interception 440 all in all special skill is great but his main skill absolutely sucks hidden skills are bond with two or more toughness type japanese players that gives everyone five percent Special skill blocks, so he will block one tackle special skill off your matchup opponent 80% of the time. He's an inside master 20%, so if you guess the right thing, he's 20% stronger. Shoot special skills force, that's why you see here uh, ground shoot is 539.4, toh combination with Yuga. Uh, so that's added automatically because that's always active and he has tenacity so he can use a special skill with normal force if his stamina is one or higher which is nice to have a forward that can always shoot yeah yeah um so as every inside master character, let's combine the talk with uh, his raw stats and when you actually guess the right thing. So, raw, he's not a bad dribbler at 70.4. When you guess the right thing, no one will stop him at 84. Uh, not a good pass at 63.4, but an excellent one if you guess the right thing at 76.7, which means he will rarely ever be bullied. Uh, nice one, 281, 67 here. Um, Raw power on shoot that I will not cover, that I will talk about later. And defensively, he is really, really nice. So if you guess the right thing, you can block and intercept. You can tackle and intercept. Because, um, you know, intercept is 69. Just shut up. You're a virgin. Uh, it's 68.6, but whatever. Uh, and, I mean, as a, as a, as a forward, 
yeah, defensively he looks really, really nice. Um, no skill block cancels, so yeah, that's kind of... Okay, so, if you shoot the first time, your shoot is 86.3, which is nothing like excellent in this meta. Uh, he is... Uh, he is a toughness type shooter. Yeah. The club. Roman is a club player killer. Uh, there's a Mueller that has a color advantage over him. So it's gonna be tough there. Okay, so you shoot the second time. If you shoot the first time, you will rarely ever score against anyone. You shoot the second time, nice, 95 uh, on a ground shoot, uh, that's his most powerful weapon. I will not cover mostly his volleys or overheads because that's just not good enough. And if you uh, shoot the second time uh, and your opening goalkeeper saves it, then you shoot the third time with this guy and then he reaches uh, really, really nice numbers with 102.6. So, uh, as a guy that reaches those numbers only when you shoot with him and spam shoots with him, I don't think that's very good. A volley, overhead, whatever, so you can just give him something else because he will not be like so powerful there. Um, yeah, you have Hugo and Nita. I would rather, I would rather use Nita if this guy was someone that buffs Hugo up by additional something. If this guy was someone that uh, that you know, uh, when you win in a matchup, Hugo gets five percent or something. Yeah. If you need someone on the sides of Yoga and he needs to be a Japanese player, I would go with Nita. Nita is so much better. Nita is actually really, really nice. And uh, they are actually really similar, but Nita is stronger. Nita is much stronger. Um, nah, I don't like Sorimachi. I don't like him. Uh, you need to spam shots. Only a third shot, if you don't score, is a respectable number. And that is kind of uh, when high bond becomes meta, his value will be skyrocketing in nice seven point eight. Could be above eight in the next couple of months. You would rate this guy seven point eight. Are you crazy, Pelita? Nah, man. Nah. No. Yeah, he's basically spam shoot and hope of RNG. That's 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 sorry much. And in a in a meta where you actually have Levin, Brian, uh all these nukers, Hyuga, um uh, I don't think that you need this guy. I don't think you need this guy. Like yeah, Levin is much stronger, Brian is stronger. Uh, Hyuga is stronger, uh, Nita is stronger, um... Okay, then you spam shoots if you like to spam shoots. I don't like to spam shoots, so he sucks for me, Palita. Let's see how did you guys rate this guy. You guys rated him 6.5. That's your opinion. 
uh if you want to be a part of this rating by the way you can join my discord and uh give your opinion of these guys uh this is what you guys think of him so um isham says 6.8 marcus says seven he can score <laughs> I'm not wasting my time spamming the shots. Game Wiz, I completely agree with you. I don't like spamming shots. I like to come in a really good situation and score and and that's it. Uh, spamming shots with a sea of character that... And Pelita says that Bond man, in the Bond meta he will rise. Why? No, that's not even true. We have we have so much stronger uh tough uh, like uh, uh we have so much stronger bonders uh forwards you don't need this guy really so yeah i don't see the i don't see the the thing in where this guy should be a like usable in the high end meta no no way that you will see this guy in superstar i i don't think so 6.5 is that fair yeah, his 1-2 is really tough to, to do, um, not a good pass, inside master, like, all around he looks really nice. So, as only a forward, I would obviously use him only as a winger, there, there maybe he can, uh, if you manage to do his Toho Trinity, um, uh, he can be helpful. He can block one tackle special skill off your matchup opponent 80% of the time, but most of the defenders have, uh, you know, two, three tackles, so it's like whatever there. Um, how would I rate this guy? Yeah, I know how how what what will I give to this guy six or seven? So I'm gonna go with six point nine and call it a day. <laughs> that's that's basically it. What do you guys think of these guys? Hey Shadow, what's up, man? Thank you, man. Thank you. Even in Kent Tsubasa, J League is so bad. <laughs> yeah. With this J League units and incoming Aoi, you can build a great debuff bond uh, Japan team with skill type non Japan players with box chats Basa to shield them with Hayato, Misaki, and Aoi. That's just 22.5 debuff. That is true. So, that is all coming into the score. Like, the how hard it is to enable someone so with Hayato, Misaki and Aoi Summit has a huge brain so you actually have to pull all three of these guys to to actually have some value in the team uh, with a huge debuff and I agree in a huge debuff team these guys are and even in a huge debuff team this is not the best score I mean if you look at like I, I don't know man you, you guys are just Yeah. Uh, you need a toughness type score. Go with debuff natureza. That's basically it. Debuff natureza is still OP. He's still meta, so why not just use him? That's it. Oh. 
So guys, tell me, speak to me. What do you think? A low baller. A low ball request. Yeah, a low ball request, Natureza. That's that that's the guy. That's the guy I'm speaking about. <laughs> yeah. All in all, if you ask me, this is the most anticlimactic J League release ever. I don't like this release at all. I think that uh, there are much, much valuable meta characters today. So I, I think they're fine. If you pull all of them, all of these debuffers, and you actually build a good team with them, you can do some damage, of course. But you need to pull all of them and um, yeah didn't age well yeah it's like yeah it should be tenacious spirit is uh, is one of these passives that club completely messed up because if you guys remember when DC Hyuga was released, everyone got their money back actually by pulling for him because they didn't explain it at all. And it only raises the shoot stat, like the the, the base shoot stat, not the shoot and power combined. It only raises the shoot stat. And that uh that uh, killed the 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 opinion of most guys when they started using Hyuga. Hyuga was good because he was actually really powerful even without that. He in that meta when that meta was there, Hyuga was good and just passed to Hyuga and Shoto because he was one of the best scorers in the game, but he was quickly quickly removed. Most of them would skip this J League banner than Misaki is not really 8 or 10, 8 out of 10. Uh, Summit, you got your money back on that banner, so whatever. Yeah. You got your money back. Like, how, how many? Three, 300 DBs or something. Yeah, you did. Everyone wasted them. Hisham says, still waiting Red Dreamfest Junior Youth Huga to get his ability. <laughs> yeah, he has a beautiful, beautiful shot. <laughs> Summit got his DBs back then zeroed on DC Michael. Yeah, imagine imagine zeroing on DC Michael. Like he was not even that good to zero it. That, 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 that just shows you how how big of a noob Summit is. Imagine imagine wailing for Dream Collection Michael when he was not really that good. <laughs> That's crazy man. That's crazy. Uh, yeah, I mean, this is it. This is all about these guys. Uh, hey guys, look at this. You create your dream team with 50% discounts or 20% or 30% discounts. Yes, you do. All you need to do is install App Gallery from Huawei. App Gallery is an official application store for Huawei devices. It's available for all Android devices and PC with emulators. Here players can enjoy the exclusive content and gifts, in special in-game events, competitions and rewards. You can join their Discord too. On their Discord you will be made aware of about every single promotion that is happening right now so you can take advantage of it. So basically what are you waiting for? You can save yourself a lot of money. Just just do it, you know, just do it. All the links are in the description of the YouTube video and the stream. Okay guys, so 
I'm Origin. Okay. <laughs> yeah, nice, nice one, Summit. And uh, then you can you you could buy it actually in the shop. Big Brain Summit. Big Brain Summit. Big Brain Summit. Imagine guys wasting DBs for a skill on a character that might get released. <laughs> and he never was released. <laughs> ah, Summit. <laughs> uh, yeah, Hisham, you are right actually. Uh, not not like entirely but uh globally yes yes yeah guys what can i say Thank you so much for watching this stream if if i helped you with analysis uh like the video if i didn't uh fuck it <laughs> if you liked it like it if you didn't like it fuck it write down in the comments below what do you guys think about uh these guys and um uh, don't forget to you know join my discord if you want to be a part of the rating you can join my discord if you're watching on uh, on twitch there is all the links you're gonna need if you're watching on youtube all the links are in the in the description if you're watching on facebook all the links are in the description uh so yeah be free to join them um and that's pretty much it of this Thank you guys so much for watching and I'm gonna see you tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm gonna play Captain Tsubasa Dream Team. Today I said I'm gonna uh, play FIFA. Will I though? Will I play FIFA? Will I play FIFA? I would love to play FIFA. I would love to play FIFA. Mr. Bad Gamer says he wants me to play FIFA. Yeah, you're not alone. I want me to play FIFA too. Yeah. Guys, thank you so much for watching and uh, see you on another one. Uh, I might stream FIFA to tonight. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna take a race now. At least for, uh, half an hour and think about it. But uh, I'm gonna post what I'm gonna do on my Discord. And uh, if I'm not gonna play FIFA today, I'm gonna play FIFA tomorrow. Don't don't sweat it. I gotta play some FIFA. I love FIFA, man. So yeah, uh, that's basically it.